In this video, we're going to demonstrate decoding the ECM pin on a 3 litre T6 petrol engine vehicle. And plug into this car, we have no keys, the ignition is not on, and the first thing we're going to need to do is decode the ECM pin. ECM decode. Decode. Start. And away it goes. ECM pin decoding is uh, about 900 keys a second, so there's a maximum time of about five hours, but uh, I'm going to pause this while it decodes. Now I happen to know that the pin is at approximately 7.1% on this uh, ECU. I haven't decoded, decoded it before. So we're just going to, uh, oh, there we go. And there we go, we've got the pin and the pin code has been saved and the pin code has automatically been written into the device so that we can now go ahead and take a backup of the ECU. We could of course follow the QR code to submit it, the pin to V- or something like that if we wanted to. Flashing menus, ECM flash, Zenzo petrol is the only module we have unlocked at the moment, and we're going to take a backup, which really is the same as uh, taking a read. Uh, read creates uh, a file called read.bin, and backup creates backup.bin, so uh, it's always good to have a backup before you do anything else anyway full read takes about 10 minutes so I'll uh, pause it and we'll come back uh, come back in a second right with the backup having now completed I'm confident to go ahead and write my modified tune file to the car so I'm going to go down to flash then so petrol I'm going to write and that's going to write the write.bin file back to the ECU is the backup file for this car. Oh, yes it is. The writing process is comparatively quick compared to the read. About three minutes. So I'll go ahead and film the whole process.
And there we go, it's done. Operation is completed. There we go. And if we want, of course, we can go and look at uh, our uh, stored pins. That's the pin code for our current ECU.